I think that you know that Nkroma indeed play a, quite a crucial role in our journey towards your friends and um, as, as independence are yes, secure. And Nkroma rural play, you no, know, it's not idea yet limited to just Ghana. Africa has will be a name the rural and Nkroma player. So as to funders day from Nkroma day, whatever, you no, know, I don't think that anybody can do anything no matter how people attempt to twist and turn history in this particular country any effort to be able to rewrite the political history of this particular country and nobody will succeed in an effort to brush aside the relevance or the role that Nkrumah played in our efforts say a secure independent so that particular attempt to say yeah yeah the founders day yeah, they be no more whatever 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 and Krumah's on his special day like this the state will definitely decide to ignore Say yeah, nah, the Biano will not change the narrative, will not change anything. In Chroma, the legacy no is highly enshrined, is highlighted on the minds of Ghanaians that Ghana for him the, the role that he played. And in the, in the quest to secure independence for this particular country, and we also saw certain attempts by certain individuals just to thwart the effort to secure the independence of this particular country all these things and i think they're gonna avoid him that so any attempt any effort any ploy any machination anything be a man for bayer just to sway Ghanaian from the reality or the realities of ghana's political history any attempt to say yes switch it just to turn it around you know i'm not sure say a best under the test of time and Kroma occupy a very special place in the heart of Ghanaians so far as your independence and your journey. Ghana, everything Ghana is concerned. Or deserve also such a recognition. I think say yeah, the man. Yes, say yeah, are there other people to eat Seba yeah? Because independence, the back of the independence. I understand that. But I think say Nkrumah's role no can be highlighted as a man for near Momo yeah. But the effort say, ye take away the shine and everything. To me, I don't think there uh, is anything that uh, anybody can succeed uh, trying to say yeah, yeah, change the political narrative or whatever. And I don't think we need to waste our time on that because it is about the, it is about the vision. It is about the path uh, or city for this particular country. And I think that uh, we take it apart from the struggle and everything from the table. Now walk we'll through the kind of ideology that Nkrumah had. I think that he left a legacy, a transcended beyond generation. That is why we are here today talking about Nkrumah. And I believe that Senka or mine a remaining focus. And then Kaye too Nkrumah, a young truncating the dream, the innovation, or all for Ghana. Ebi and Kaye, Ghana, your friends say. A force to reckon with at the global arena, but unfortunately, no one in Chroma was year uh, two. No, no, his dreams, his vision, his plan, everything was equally truncated. If we say, bro, not knowing, say, because the gentleman had a plan for Ghana's development, and within the short period, I'll be here. If you look at some of the things that he did, the initiative, ah, or the buy, and she said, First one, eh, yeah, the industrialization drive or start is eh, for Ghana. Yeah, yeah, hub, uh, yeah, well, raw material, everything. So, you yeah, can see a start something like industrialization. Yeah, and so far, all we have to do is eh, put it up the structures and the raw material. I had to those in the air, no, eh, eh, well, chrome, huh? So, it wasn't a big deal. And in Chroma started building factories across this particular country. And more and more reading the political history of this particular country and then come and you also and oh yes i need man your power generation capacity a bit me are facilitating the industries and other stuff coming on stream at that particular time he saw all these things he created a motorway and to the extent that tema he made tema an industrial city production industrialization drive nana or the banner it wasn't just a uh, yeah your friend is saying uh, politics, okay, but rather created the whole city, industrial city. Yeah, but me making sure that, that particular, yeah, for the same plan, they were no or no, they're coming to realization. So he had an actual plan to transform every sector of this particular economy. Railway sector was another industry, yeah, turning attention. And those of you who well, very, yeah, for the same more money. Near may see at that time, no, what test to the fact that uh, the railway industry was was booming under Nkrumah those days. 
a Ghana for our more go into that particular arena and know a lot and aside that several other areas just say the same no casa will come about the plans and the visions and the things that he had that uh yeah can 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 yeah me that so uh, beyond the history you know i think that uh, in chroma i was step ahead of his contemporaries so any attempt say yeah uh, try to just take away the fact just to make sure say yeah yeah you see these things you know i'm not sure say be, a best standard the test of time because ghana for any any story and in the in the in the in the in the in the pages of ghana's political history in the name in chroma is written down boldly in, in in that particular book and i'm not sure anybody can change anything so whether founders day and chroma's birthday whatever the state will celebrate the founders day and ignore chroma's birthday whatever whatever no i don't know doesn't change anything the fact they say nkroma has a place and in a legacy in a for a olive we you know continue to ring bell in the minds a level an indelible imprint on the conscience of Ghanaians forever and ever you no know? i'm sure say he will have a better place to live on the on the minds of Ghanaians so uh and yeah there we need to worry about say certain effort being made to just reduce the essence and the relevance of Nkrumah in the political history of this particular country. And to me, I think that is irrelevant. Second questioner, yeah, what was him say? Is David Anson? Or say, is democracy a bad thing for Africa and Ghana? Democracy, a yeah, the bone for yeah, na. Now say, is there any other form of government anchor if we say bit me boy more than democracy? I think that this is not the first time I hear about democracy. Last now me catch us say I will go with when Sin Churchill or Car said democracy is the worst form of government except other ones na in yam trial. So to me, I think democracy is the best thing because it is the system of government that afford opportunity to be irrespective of background race where you're coming from whether you are rich or poor sick or well well informed or uninformed you know i call the obiad opportunity to make contribution in diverse way whichever way possible a give you recognition and relevance to obia and this is where some of the modalities like elections and then as a former when we go to the post to elect people uh, a give you obia once you are 18 and you meet all the criteria you have your right to express whatever and you necessarily a vote you say and as you hear any vote you say so democracy in its essence you know, to me i think is the best form of government uh, 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 happen to the world it's unfortunate say, in our part of the world you no know, we don't understand the concept so in our attempt to say yeah, yeah, be a be a, no, is the reason why we are not realizing the fortunes democracy is supposed to offer us democracy isn't a bad thing but you know and i you know who said they sit here because i have told you sir for democracy to work best within a society you know everybody must be on top of the first issue people must be armed with information people must be politically conscious socially viable people must be awakened that decisions that they make within a, con a democratic construct you know, must not be based on emotions must not be must not be based on association affiliation affinity or whatever it must be based on the facts and nipa one who said after weighing all the options you know available you know, this is the best option that i can take and say saline and ankaye koswa that is at that point in a bit you realize the essence of democracy but uh, because of sending the end and as a form of form no some of the things as you did democracy they are substituting you know, and i had the emotions yeah, the tribalism and i hear the yeah, friends, and that religious orientation and a whole lot of stuff and i hear the a substitute to the critical element of democracy you know in the any way and it's the reason why it is not working better for us because say democracy for the opportunity says say, would it to me more be a, the person has to account to you and ensure say accountability now or account you know I, I, yeah, I, I, yeah, within your friend is saying 
eh emra kwan so a se nipa do di fo a mun sese ne asotwe e wo se de ma no but se enam se ya ties ne we we ya emotions it is about party it is about this that no we are not able to demand that accountability from them and politicians will always and always capitalize on some of these 